I can't, I could have never moved my arms, so. You did, you learned. We're still in Philly getting some late breakfast slash lunch. Put the hell out of there. Gina's starting her new thing, Gina. <laughs> Gina's decided moving forward, she's gonna be a food critic for restaurants because she loves them. I want you guys to give her lots of encouragement. Uh, tell me about your meal here at right. Bluestone. What's so what, I have avocado toast. Yeah. It's amazing. And by the way, I'm sure you all know I'm like a huge foodie. Yes, I huge. Love going out to we, you've been a foodie since I've known you, and we would pretend to be food critics. We always use this. Yeah, we did. So, so what do you got here? Avocado toast. It's got feta cheese, blistered red tomatoes. Really delicious. It's so fresh. I've, I haven't tried that yet. Got a beet latte. It's delicious. Currently at Bluestone. That's the name of this place. If I continue to do this? Yes, give her encouragement. We I'm, all want you to be a food critic in New York City. I'm going to give you like legit reviews. Yeah. Right? We are always about scaring Nyla and Bamboo. You should get that. <laughs> that would totally scare the out of them. <laughs> It's if like you, this full-size stuff. Have you ever tried the uh, cucumber thing where you put a cucumber? Oh, we did try that. It didn't work. Did? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. To but see you, if they get scared. But if you had something like that, she did lose it. Kyla <laughs> would yell no. I know. She's done that. No, 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 no. Do I put that mask on? Yeah. Nyla, <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Look at Nyla. <laughs> Nyla. She doesn't know. Does he, does he has this thing Nyla. like this? Oh, my God. Look at her ears. Look at her ears. <laughs> It's only me, Nyla. And I put it on, I'm like, dee, 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 dee. I look over, I see not. <laughs> I wanted to get Who one of those cat apartment? masks. Where? In the one in Jersey. Oh, so if you guys didn't know, a viewer actually bought our old house from Jersey. Really? It was Yeah, a you knew this. I didn't know for sure. Yeah, I remember the lady took the picture of us at the closing so she could show her son. Uh, I wonder like, what it looks like in there. I'd love to see you it. You know, we should hit them up one day because I, ha I have her number. Just knock on the door. And just show up because we, we left all the furniture. We did. We sold the furniture. How do you not remember this? Shit. Everything. They it's got like the house. They castle. got literally the PVP house. The original one where it all started. Be weird if we went back and it was exactly the same. That'd be really weird to see it like that and then someone else living there. I want to see it. All right, you're gonna get copyright and change infringement from the ice cream man. I don't know. I'm <laughs> just joking. Just say I'm gonna get copyright from the ice cream man. Um, we are here at the art museum. Yeah, so Jean's been vlogging too, guys, if you didn't know. There she is doing it right now. And if you want to go check out the vlog, she's done. I'm going to beat you. You're not, I'm not racing you. Because you know I'm going to win. You will. I'm tired right <laughs> now. I worked out. I did legs. I got a hoodie on. A hoodie? I got a hoodie, a hoodie? on too. Oh. All right. Are you ready? Ready? Are you set. Yes. Go. Come on. Just a teeny bit. All right. At the last stretch. To the rocky shoes. Oh, stretchy. Jesse got thinner. What? I did? Yeah, but in a good way. I mean, like, you used to be buff. Remember? Yeah. You were Jersey Shore, Jesse. That's what everyone says in the comments. <laughs> like, you used to be so big. So this was my run all the time in Philly. This was part of it. I would run up these steps, and I would go up, like, ten times. My legs were dead. But I got so used to it. So if you ever want to come, it's a great workout. Oh. All right, we have to run this last. No. The last stretch. We have to run it. Right here. Come no. on. Come on. Go. Come on. <laughs> we ran the whole way. You ran, you did. We ran the entire step. Jesse ran two steps. There's your oh. dad's shoes. There's my pop's shoes. He had Converse in that. The trick that nobody knows, I mean, I guess you should know this, but nobody does it. When people come to the Rocky Steps, they literally run all the way up and they stop here where the Rocky shoes are and they think that's it. But if you're a true Philly person, you would go all the way up to the art museum, steps back there, and go up and down. I saw what Rocky did. It doesn't matter. It's for for the full experience, and you can see yeah. such a better view Wait, up maybe there. Maybe he did do that. I don't remember. <laughs> Are you singing the ice cream song? <laughs> this is the back of the art museum. I've said this in the vlogs before, but it's beautiful. If you come to Philly, like you have to check out behind the art museum. A lot of people don't know to do that, but it's really beautiful back here. It looks like it looks like a painting. And even up there, like you'd have to come from the art museum and go up there. It's really pretty. This was my regular running route all along this this path. I love the fall trees and the color. It's so pretty. Where's 
that cool? <laughs> How do you feel doing all this walking? You're not used to We don't this. walk in LA, it's kind of sad. <laughs> I'm I gonna see how I many miles I've lot. walked. But you're a New Yorker now, I that's know. what you guys do, and you walk fast. I walk so fast. It's like, I walk fast anyway, but it's becoming a habit to go really fast. Wow, Jesse did 10,000 steps today. Friday, right, I did 13,000. That's good. So we made our way all the way to Rittenhouse Square. This is the park. That we used to hang out a yeah. lot in. Like, I'm like, beautiful people, park. Like, I'm like, Best park in Philadelphia. Yeah. If you ever come to Philadelphia, come to Rittenhouse Square. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Really pretty. You can see the buildings. Liberty Place. Liberty One and Two. What's nice about Rittenhouse Square, there's so many different people who play music. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but this guy has a full on like organ, right? Oh, it's a piano. It's not a, a piano. It's definitely not an organ. Well, aren't those, what are they called? Uh, Wait, what's it called? An electric piano, I don't know. Yeah, the small ones, the portable ones. And then there's other girls there over there singing. We do things in Philly, okay? But they do this everywhere. But they're actually good in Philly, that's the thing. Yeah. Those are the big school, the big music schools right here, so I think we get a lot of runoff from students coming in just flexing. You know what's the hardest thing? Actually, I'll let you guys know. The hardest thing while editing is finding the music. Do you agree? That takes forever. Usually, yeah. it takes so long. But they don't care about the music. I know, but like, I, for me to edit and post a video, like that's part of what well, I All you gotta do is do. just sit in the park and Yeah, but now I don't have to have played. any music, so thank you, Rittenhouse. <laughs> yeah, music is just playing in the background. This is great, and it's not copyrighted, so it's even better. To make you feel my love. What's up, guys? How you doing? Hi. What's your name? My name is Kay. Hi, Kay. Nice to meet you. Oh my god. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh yeah. Nice. We immediately walked up to me and said, "Who put me here today?" I would only do that in Philly. I watched you guys since I was like 12. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> we didn't think we were going to do this, but we're watching the sledding down the Rocky Steps video. <laughs> and you used to go fast, yo. <laughs> Jesse changed like the way he talks. I do. Yo, get that jaw on, yo. But Philly, it's more Philly. Yeah, we need to figure out which videos. Jesse said it on his channel. By the way, if you didn't know, Jesse made a video too. Make sure you check it out. We did a lot of content out here in Philly and... um. Show us both love, so. And we appreciate all the support. You guys have like tremendously flooding the comments, the thumbs up, and you guys still go ham, so ham. ham. <laughs> That's what we always would say. And um, we love you for that, so thank you. Love you guys. Love you. I'm gonna show you guys one more spot and then we're ending it. All right, so this is the spot I wanted to show you guys, the Bruno Brothers. This is a staple in Philly, if you did not know, and you want some good food, a good little market, you gotta check this out. This is the one that I used to go to all the time in my neighborhood. It's got really good food. And it's like a fun market. They have like interesting snacks. It's like an Italian market. I used to get the string beans a lot. And chicken parm. I got lasagna sometimes, eggplant parm. Brussels sprouts. <laughs> Did you like the salmon here? It was all right. I remember that some one of our viewers used to work here, maybe a couple. Do you think they just put this song on purpose? Oh, uh, what? <laughs> That's weird. Uh, why you have to remind me? This is always such an no emotional spin. song. I'm getting chicken parm, string beans. This was legit, like my favorite spot. I used to come here all the time. They have the best little sweets. They have really good, interesting drinks. All kinds of yummy candy. Of course, you know I hit up this aisle and that aisle and the dinner was good. What? Yeah, of course. <laughs> we used to get those too, the yummy chocolate covered pretzels. All right guys, I'm gonna end the vlog. It was so nice to get together with Jesse and you guys got to see us together again. And uh, we'll be making more videos in the future, so don't forget to smash the thumbs up button. <laughs> yeah, let's get it trending yes, again. Again, that'd be awesome. All right, I love you guys. Bye. Peace on the streets. Peace.